The deputy governor who was represented by the permanent secretary Ministry of Youth and Gender Issues, Peter Osagi, observed that virus can circulate and cause polio outbreak even in area which were previously declared white polio free. He explained that this is the reason continued vaccination against polio is needed to ensure that affected area remain polio free. Children from 0 to 5 years of age, the deputy governor noted, will be administered two drops of the novel Aoro vaccine type 2 alongside other antigens that are due. This occasion is to sensitize the people of the state on the importance of the immunization of their children and to demonstrate publicly our support for this important exercise. The novel oral polio vaccine type 2 is an improved type of polio vaccine that is highly effective at protecting children from the polio virus and permanent paralysis. The novel oral polio vaccine, along with the existing polio vaccines, is recommended by the World Health Organization and the Nigeria National Agency for Food, Drug Administration and Control. Executive Secretary at the State Primary Health Care Development Agency, Dr. Omosigo Izedome, was represented by the Director of Disease Control in the agency, Dr. Gideon Erauya, remarked that even though Nigeria is free from white polio virus, there are still outbreak of circulating vaccine derived polio virus type 2 in Africa. He said the ceremony is an avenue for stakeholders to come together and give public demonstration of acceptance and endorsement for the exercise. I want to appeal to all stakeholders that in our various states of life we can try as much as possible to get our mothers to bring their children to, their, to our facilities for immunization against polio. World Health Organization representative Dr. Ayo Nora in a goodwill message observed that Nigeria has maintained a high level of polio immunization through house-to-house -house vaccination campaign. Surveillance and reinforcement of routine immunization against re-emergency of the circulating mutant polio virus. High point was the administration of vaccine of children on affected age range. Joseph Ikbuda, EBS News.